Okay, Wednesday. A little change around with the rods. I've done a two and a one because I'm fishing these two. They're still in the same spots. But one is there. The other one is further down. I'll put it, make the most of the water I've got. <clears throat> the fish is still here because it's still crashed, but they're very, very tricky. Very, very wary. They see a lot of pressure. See a lot of pressure. Would have gone a bit of shit or bust now because I was worried about how much bait people had put in the, the party before us the week. Now it's Wednesday, so their bait should have gone, so I didn't start heavy baiting. I'm being quiet because I'm fishing on the rocks. I didn't start heavy baiting until I know where I was baiting, because I didn't know whether I was going to stick to this swim move or what. But that's what's left the 10 kilo of cell, 15 and 18. And I've put 10 kilo of particle out because they, uh, they feed them that. And they'll have one tub of tiger nuts. So that's what's left of the t on my tiger nuts. And I've also added 5 kilo. I've got another one here. I've added a full bag, 5 kilo bag. Is it 5 kilo? <coughs> New bag, mainline pellet, hashtag mainline. So let's see what you can do for me. I mean, the fish are here, they haven't moved from here, so you know, I've picked one off. I lost a massive lump in the night, or you know, they all feel massive, but I lost a lump in the night, which pissed me off. Um, nothing I could do about it, you know. I'm fishing locked up, stopping going through them islands, but uh, but yeah, I thought. Shit or bust, it's Wednesday, I've got three nights left. The fish are here, they're not moving from here, so let me feed them and see if I can pick up uh, a couple more. I hope. See, we're getting liners already made from that fish that's crashed. The problem I got, I'm fishing at a right angle. I've been tried back leading, but I just had a just had a, a bend round a minute ago or half an hour ago. Rod rod bent round. The back lead lifted up, so I hit, hit into it, and nothing there, so I don't know if someone's got away with it or what. But, uh, you know, they've been struggling with suffering from bird life over there, but I haven't had any, because I'm sat in the bivvy, I can't see. I can't see what's going on in the swim. All I can do is hear them. Basically, I'm fishing. I'm fishing two rods. Really, that's just going out to the right in the margin, just because it's here. Really, it's not done anything. But you never know. It might pick a straggler up. You never know, dear. So the two rods is ample down there, if not too much, really. You know, I did try one in the margins, just to keep it out of the way, because I didn't want to sit here for a week and fish one rod. So. I've upped my game and back leaded my left hand rod so it didn't interfere with the right hand rod because the problem you've got, I'm fishing at them from, from a strange angle my line is going all the way down the swim and I think that is what's pissing them off so I tried back leading it um, I'll give it a go, get, try and get it out of the way but I'm still getting liners and what just happened a minute ago, I've left it off it now just to try it again, I've still got the middle rod back leaded that's going over there but I've just kind of slack lined that one down there now because I oh, fucking hate back leads they're a pain in the arse you know you just pivot on your line you don't get the information I need you know I'm fishing the rocks up last thing I want to do is get up and be a rod gone if I could hear that I can't see it I think that's beyond the islands in Mr. Ferrier's water, but they're all down here. There we go, there we go. That's literally 
15 yards from a bait that that jumped so to say that jump there my base there so I've got some bait I haven't put tie bags I've scattered it all the way down my channel obviously where I'm fishing I've put most of the bait but you see that there is tight on the island whereas you know I've commit I'm not committed enough I've spread it around so I can I can really drop a bait anywhere in my channel I can really put a bait anywhere in there and I'm still fishing on or next to my baited area I've spread it out spread it I've spread it out to keep them moving you know single boilers with a catapult and then the bait boat with a particle well, it's only fine chopped maize and pellet and tiger nuts I've tried to scatter as much as I can so not to concentrate so they don't know because I think they're just probably wary of the bait boat dump better off spreading it out a bit <laughs> 